This is the story of one of Fivey Castle's most famous ghosts, the Green Lady. Lord Alexander Seaton was the first Earl of Dunfermline, a lawyer, judge and politician, a Roman Catholic and loyal supporter of Mary Queen of Scots, even after her abdication from the throne and exile in England in 1567. His wife, Lilius Drummond, was the daughter of the third Lord Drummond, who upon her marriage had become the Baroness Fivey. It was believed that the Seaton's Fivey Castle had been cursed by Thomas the Rhymer, a laird with a reputation for prophecy and supernatural powers. Thomas the Rhymer said that no male heir would ever be born within the walls of Fivey Castle, unbeknown to Lilius and Alexander. From that day on, Fivey Castle's curse caused misery for the Seaton's, and Lilius's future was bleak because of it, particularly after her husband began an affair with her cousin, Grizel Leslie. But what would happen next? Would the Seatons ever produce a male heir? Would their marriage survive the curse? Would Lilius ever discover her husband's infidelity? In Sue Lawrence's historical novel, The Green Lady, Lilius's story is explored even further than ever before.